What is going on everyone? My name is Toon Mike and today we're going to be playing Smashing 4. I hope you guys had a good weekend. Thank you so much for stopping by watching today's video of Smashing 4. We are creeping up in the 300 subscriber marks. Thank you so much for the continued support. Like little by little you guys are joining into my channel and it means the world to me that you guys are just giving me the support from wherever you are. Just thank you so very much. Uh, but today we're going to be playing Smashing 4. They actually released a, a new update. So now instead of three deck slots, we can hold up to five deck slots, which is very good. Like if you want to just uh, experiment new decks, that's that's really cool. That's that's actually really cool. I honestly like it in my opinion. I, and they also added a new uh, online indicator. So now you can see who in the clan is online at the very moment, which is actually very cool. So if you want to do friendly battles, you can at least know who is online. And um, they actually also reduced the uh, the trophies when you when you get three in a row. Instead of fifteen additional trophies, you get ten. I I guess fifteen trophies was a little bit too much. So I think with ten, in my opinion, ten is also okay. Like I I I can't complain about ten trophies. Ten trophies is pretty cool. Today we're gonna be playing in the ladder with the max out deck. You guys actually told me to do longer videos and. Uh, so this is what we're gonna do. Today we're gonna be we're just gonna grind out in the ladder. Just grind on the ladder and we're gonna do it for one hour. So now I want to apologize ahead of time if there's gonna be interruptions in the in the video when it comes to maybe phone calls, messages, notifications. I'm sorry, I'm gonna edit it, I'm gonna edit those out. So you might be so, so you might see a couple of edits here and there. So I do apologize if you guys uh don't like the edits. But it is what happens when you, it sometimes it happens when I'm making a video and uh, making an hour long video, which I plan to do so. Hopefully we don't get as many interruptions as I think that we're going to get. So fingers crossed that that doesn't happen. And um, let's actually hit the goblin before I, I keep talking. Okay, there you go. And hit the barbarian. Okay. But uh, yeah, we're going to be playing for a full hour. So hopefully... We get a good bunch of wins. Hopefully, we get to four thousand trophies, and um, hopefully, uh, hopefully, I I do hope that you guys uh, I do hope that you guys actually enjoy it. And this I, this guy actually surrendered. Never mind. <laughs> so there you go. There's our first one. It's probably gonna be only ten trophies. Ten trophies? Yes. No. Thank you. Yep. Ten trophies. So uh, yeah, that's what we're going to be doing today. Let me know down in the comments below if you guys like our long videos. I'm going to try to do it whenever I can. It's probably going to be only in the ladder, um, in the, uh, pushing up ladder videos. Because you don't know what to expect whenever I'm playing the Majestic Challenge. But here in the ladder, we can just play as many as we want. And just hopefully we can end it on the positive note. Let's just jump into another one. And... Uh, I got a question for you guys. What do you guys do in the, over the weekend? What do you guys do over the weekend? So me and my wife, we uh, we went out to eat. It was actually her birthday. It was actually a lot of fun. We actually went to, uh, what's it called? Fred's Market. It's like a buffet style uh, restaurant. It was pretty good, pretty good in my opinion. Uh, let's hit the bummer over here. Uh, like this. The bomber's dead. Okay, that was very good. <laughs> I didn't expect the bomber to just die instantly. But uh, yeah, let me know down in the comments below what you guys over, uh, do over the weekend. I would love to read your comments. So he is going to use the goblin. The goblin activated the berserker's ability. Okie doke. If we can actually hit the striker and make the goblin hit the berserker, that will be a lot of damage. So let's do that. It worked. Okay, and the knight hit the treant. Okay. So now he should kill the Berserker, which I totally understand if he wants to do so. I don't think you even have to do that. You just gotta... Yeah, you didn't even have to do that. And that actually also killed the Striker, so I think you were supposed to do that. Never mind. Whew. Okay, okay. This is getting a little bit... This is... This is starting to look a little bit difficult. So let's actually hit the Goblin like this. We should be able to hit the Treant as well, unless the Goblin is just too lightweight that the Skeleton is not gonna go up. Never mind. I hit the goblin twice, making it die. I did not plan that. <laughs> I plan. I mostly do not plan things. 
and it just sometimes work out. Um, also, let me know what uh, challenge decks would you guys like uh, like me to do. I also received uh, a comments from you guys, a challenge deck that you guys want me to do. So I'm actually gonna do that for tomorrow's video. Hopefully you guys uh, stay tuned for that, Ho and hopefully that you guys enjoy that video. Hopefully I perform well tomorrow. This guy's gonna. Oh, why would you go for the? You should go for the. You should have went for the uh, the knight because if the skeleton dies and the knight stays alive, the skeleton will revive. So why did you go for the skeleton? That's my question. And that was very good, in my opinion. I hit the warrior twice plus the train once. That's pretty good. He might actually kill off the knight right here. Not what he wanted to do. Wow. Okay, so let's actually take care of the warrior because the warrior can actually kill us, especially when we're low health. The Treant cannot do much. I actually cannot do any ability. Not He cannot do any ability at all. So... So yeah, he's gonna go for the Knight. Okay. Will he kill the Knight? He did indeed kill the Knight. Okay. So I have 1100 health. He has 17. The Treant needs to hit me three times. Okay. The treant needs to hit me three times. So let's actually hit him towards the ball. Just to be safe. Let's hit him towards the ball. Because right now the treant needs to get hit twice. And he needs to hit me three times. Okay. So this is it. This is my last chance. I need to hit him twice. I'm in a very uncomfortable position, to be honest with you. Unless I hit him towards the ball, I honestly don't know if that's going to be enough damage. Yes, actually, it is going to be enough damage. So let's try to hit him towards the ball. Hopefully, I do not mess this up. Hopefully not. Come on. Oh, no. Okay, that was my mistake. I should have tried to hit him twice. I should have tried to hit him twice. That was a big mistake on my part. I'm d I'm definitely gonna lose what uh, forty trophies. I'm probably gonna lose forty trophies here. It's all good. Second match, I failed. That was a that was a big mistake on my part. Oh well, how many trophies did I lose? Yep, thirty nine. So we're down twenty nine trophies right now. Obviously not the greatest start, but we are gonna go up. We are pro hopefully we end on a positive note, as in we get more trophies than we started. And uh, okay, we are facing a mice bandit, which obviously my opinion. I'm pretty sure you guys are are tired of hearing me uh, complain about it, but the mice bandit is still strong in my opinion. Like it needs a nerf. It is it needs a desperate nerf, in my opinion. It needs an emergency nerf. However you like to say it, it just needs a nerf. Okay, that's fine that you went for the skeleton because the skeleton, if if my troop stay al stays alive and it's his turn, the skeleton will revive. So that was a lot of damage, especially to the archer. That was very good. So he is going to go for the berserker, understandable. But you did activate my berserker's ability, which you probably did not want to do that, sir. So let's actually go for the archer. It should hit the berserker. And the berserker should hit the warrior? I failed to hit it towards the warrior, but this, the, ar the the archer did die. So that's what I wanted to do. Sorry, I'm, sorry that I'm looking away. I'm looking at the computer like always in my every video. Uh, interesting, they're, they're going for the knight and not the, uh, the berserker. You should go for the berserker. Never mind, you actually went for the knight. So, okie dokie, can I... No, I'm in an uncomfortable position, sadly. So we're gonna hit the mice banner, we're gonna hit it twice. I wanted to take advantage of the, of the Berserker's ability, but unfortunately I wasn't able to do so. Because I wanted to. I wanted my Berserker to hit the warrior, but obviously that I couldn't do it. But it's all good. Let me actually move the camera a little bit lower so we can see how much trophy he has. So as you can see, this guy has... Oh! Okay, so the, he did kill my skeleton, but my skeleton revives, so this is what I mean, like, do not kill off my skeleton. Not only that the skeleton revived, it actually has more health than than what it ended on. So, you played poorly, sir. So this will be 50 trophies for me. So thank you very much. What was I saying <laughs> before before I got distracted with the interactions that, we just, that just happened? 
Um, wait, let me let me get the epic win, or at least try to get the epic win. There you go, we got the epic win. So there you go, that's 50 trophies. Um, what else? What else, what else? Okay, there's a rare, a rare orb. Uh, let me know, let me know what, uh, how many trophies you guys currently have. Let me know down in the comments below. Let me also know if, if for those who still hasn't, uh, written down in the comments where are you guys from, let me know where you guys from. Like, you guys are awesome. Like, all of you guys are from the east side of the world. Or west side, depending how you look at it, to be honest with you. But not, but not a single person has written me from, from United States. So, I'm actually very happy to see to see all you guys are from Europe, from Asia, you know, like, Ukraine, New England, all the good stuff, Malaysia, like, India, like, you guys are awesome that you guys have supported me from literally different countries around the world, so I really appreciate that. So we activated this guy's uh, Berserker, which we don't want. We would like to kill it off if we can, but it doesn't seem like we're going to be able to do so. So we're gonna hit the ball towards the archer and then hit the berserker. Hopefully we can hit the berserker twice, being enough to kill it off. I don't think that's enough. I needed the berserker to hit the knight, not the striker. So now, yeah, somehow he hit me twice. Okie dokie. So we, now we need to kill it off. We cannot keep it alive. So let's hit him like this and we should be able to hit the, the archer as well. And we were able to hit the archer twice, plus the berserker hit the, the yeti. So, okay, decent damage all around. If we lose this, it's going to be a lot of trophies, like 50 trophies. If he activates the berserker right now, when it's the berserker's turn, we might be... Never mind, he killed it off. He did a triple kill. I'm just going to surrender. There's no need to stay. <laughs> There's no need to stay for that. That was embarrassing. That was a very good play on his part. So we won 50 trophies and then lost it. <laughs> okay. I usually don't surrender, but after a, a play like that, he deserves a win. He deserves a win. So, okay, so we are facing a Mice Bandit. You know how I am with Mice Bandits. Like, if, like whenever I get the Mice Bandit to level 20, I'm gonna join the team. Unless the Mice Bandit gets a serious nerf. So let's hit the Goblin directly. The goblin actually died. I did not plan for the goblin to hit the knight twice. So the goblin died. That was good because goblin was level 20, right? Let me move my camera a bit. Yeah, the goblin was level 20. And now the striker died. Okay, so now we're just... We're just making trades here. We're just making trades. So let's hit the warrior like this. We might not be able to hit the, the archer. Actually, we were able to hit the archer, and the archer touched the ball. I would have preferred if the archer would have hit the knight. Okay, so we need to worry about... Okay, his archer is pretty dangerous, of course, but... You know, the mice bandit... You cannot sleep on the mice bandit and the warrior as well, so... Let's actually hit the warrior like this. We should be able to hit the knight. Yep. Oh, wow, we actually hit the archer as well, so that's pretty good. So this is the archer's turn. He actually might be able to kill off the, the berserker here. Nope. But he did activate my uh, my berserker's ability, so let's actually... We should be able to kill him off right here, right? Or should we... Yeah, let's do this. We actually might be... We actually might hit the, the archer twice and not go for the... It might not go for the berserker. Yep. It did touch the ball, so the the archer is almost dead. He is not gonna go for the berserker. Actually, he might. He might be able to do so. Oh, never mind. Yeah, he did. So lucky play on his part. I thought he was gonna miss, but no. The this, the warrior actually did kill it off. So let's actually hit the mice bandit. Hopefully, the skeleton will go up and hit the warrior as well. Nope, made a little bit of a misplay right there, but. It's okay, the warrior cannot one-shot my troops because my troops have more health than than her ability requires to. Okay. We could kill off the, the archer. So let's 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 do this. Let's kill off the archer. My game.
game is a little bit laggy. I do apologize for about that. So let's do this, and we should be able to hit the warrior. Yeah. Yes, yes, we did. Okay, so we did maximize as much as we could have in that in that round. So in order for the warrior to kill both my troops in one shot, the troops needs to be what 980 something, right? 993, and my troops have of course over 1,000 health. The that knight has 2,000 health. Yeah, there's no way that there's no way this person is gonna beat me. Unless he finds a way to hit the knight like four times and the skeleton twice. Like there's no way he doesn't have enough speed to do so. So Yep, there you go, we won that. So another win. Another win in the books. Boop. Okay. So that's of course another ten trophies. So obviously ten trophies is not enough if especially if what if I want to go high. So Oh, I can claim the reward here. Let me claim the reward real quick. There you go. And uh, now I need to play 10 matches. So it'll be easy since I'm playing literally for an hour. I don't mind doing this. I honestly hope that you guys actually enjoy an hour long videos. Let me know now in the comments below if you actually do enjoy the video after you watch the video, of course. Or you can write, or you can write it while you're watching the video. I don't mind either way. I love reading your guys' comments, it actually makes my day. So let's hit the Naga straight up, let's just hit the, the Naga straight up. There you go. I made the ball active, so that's okay. He has a pirate, which is very interesting. I would I would have expected a, maybe um, a tanky card. Don't, don't get me wrong, the, the, the pirate can, can be tanky if you keep it alive. Um, there's no reason to to hit the pirate because it is a pirate's turn, so the pirate's gonna heal. So let's just hit the Naga, the Frost Fox, and hopefully the zombie. Yes, yes we did. We were we were able to do that. Okay. Level 20 zombie. I'm a little jealous about that. I am trying to get my zombie to level 20 because I would like to enchant. So let's act oh let's actually do this. Let's hit the pirate. We should be able to hit the pirate twice, and we should be able to hit either the Naga, the Frost Fox, or even both of them. Uh, right here. Yeah, look at that. We actually hit the Naga twice, the pirate twice, the Frost Fox just once, and the zombie just once. So, everybody got damaged. That was very good. Very good. It is the zombie's turn. He is probably gonna enchant my my skeleton he is gonna try to go for the berserker as well mm. no oops I received a notification oh let me get rid of that real quick so let's see sorry about the interruptions like I said we're gonna receive a couple of interruptions but I hope you guys don't mind it I just gotta edit those out a little bit so let's actually hit the pirate we actually hit the skeleton with it, so he the, the pirate received 1166 damage. That was a lot. That was actually a lot. The pirate is about to die. Ooh, okay. So we can actually do this. Let's hit both of these guys. I don't think it's gonna... Hopefully the pirate... No, the pirate did not receive a, a second hit. If he would have a, a, got a second hit, he would have died if it was for uh, against the knight or the skeleton. So, the Berserker ability is activated. Should we? Yeah, let's do this. Let's actually go down. I would like to hit the Frost Fox towards the Striker if I can. I would like to do that. So, let's see if we can. Yes, yes we did. And we also hit the, the Zombie. That was bonus damage in my opinion, hitting the Zombie. Oh, but he is gonna... Yeah, this is gonna be bad. Oh. Yeah. Of course. Okay, let's see. 121. Yeah, there's no way we're gonna win this one. We failed. We indeed failed. Man, I am trying to get constant wins that I literally can't. I can't do it. Uh, let's see. Yeah, I mean, no matter what we do, we, we lost, so. Unless he fails to hit the knight, which is almost, which is impossible. He just needs to bounce it off the wall and he'll win. Yeah, there you go, he got it. 
So that's what? I lost 35 trophies? 37? 38. Okay, so... We are low. We are... We... We start... We're, we're going down, which is not good. Not good. I would like to end it on the positive note. So, come on. We need to win. We need to win in a row. Come on. Let, we need to get those wins. Come on. Come on. So we are facing a sorceress, which is... A little bit scary in my opinion, and also the sorceress goes next, which I do not want to uh, her to do so. Okay, let's see what the sorceress wants to do. He is actually gonna go for the berserker. Okay, the berserker ability is activated. Unfortunately, I cannot punish her for that. So instead, we're just gonna hit both of these guys, or should we? We can probably just go for the sorceress like this. The sorceress does need to die, do not want anybody enchanted. We were actually able to also hit the goblin twice, which is super good. Hopefully he doesn't hit the berserker, I would like the berserker alive. Never mind, he hit the berserker and now the berserker is dead. Did not want that, but hey, you, you, cannot, you cannot tell the person what you don't want them to do, right? <laughs> so let's just hit the bomber and the train. So, uh, yeah, unfortunately we couldn't do much there, but the, th the rest of my troops are fully healed, so let's see what he does. So he didn't, he didn't punish that very well. That was a poor punish, to be, honest, to be honest with you. So let's actually hit the goblin. This should be death, because it should go for the ball. Yeah, it should hit the ball. I wanted the ball to hit the, the treant and the treant going up to the skeleton, but obviously I missed. So who is it next? The bomber's turn? Bomber is doing what, 785 damage? Like that's that's a lot. Hopefully he just hits once and not goes Okay, he only hit once, okay. So let's actually I cannot punish the sorceress. I want to hit the sorceress. So let's actually hit the treant with the striker and the striker should uh, I mean the trans should go for the skeleton. Yep, 834 damage. That's a lot of damage. So hopefully he doesn't poison anybody. I'll ex well not poison and en enchant anybody. I'll accept one enchantment though. On the skeleton. Hopefully she he enchants the skeleton. Never mind. He enchanted the striker as well. Oh, of course he did. So let's go for the let's go for the. Sorceress. Actually, we can do this. We can hit both of these guys. It should hit the striker as well. Actually, it didn't. Okay. We did hit the uh, the sorceress twice, which I'm actually excited about. Do not enchant. Do not enchant the knight, please. That would be very bad. So let's actually try to do this. Actually, that's not gonna work. Let's hit the knight. It might not, might not be able to do anything. Oh, actually, I was able to do something. Okay, so we did kill off the sorceress. The knight still has over 3,000 health. We should be able to have this in the books. Like, we should be able to win this one. That's 1,300 damage. As you can see, the freaking... The freaking bombers just does high damage. So let's go for the treant. This treant should die. Nope, the treant is still alive, but it is one hit away from dying. Yep, one hit away. So we need to go for the bomber now. I should have definitely went for the bomber instead of the treant right there. So this should be death. Yeah, this should be death right here. Yep, there you go. Death. So, okay. So this person has one chance to win. And he actually might get it. If he plays this off well, he might get it. Okay, the skeleton is saved. The skeleton got saved. If the skeleton was near the bomb, I would have rage quit probably. So let's just finish that off. There you go. There's another win. I'm, I'm probably going to put a, uh, a counter somewhere around here. 
uh, just to let you guys know how many wins, how many losses we have, and also uh, how many trophies are we winning or losing. So, whew, right now we're just, we're, we're probably just average right here. Oh, actually, I should have probably went back and uh, started opening orbs, just to keep the orb slots open. So, we are facing against, okay. Okay, not the, okay, not scary. Not dangerous. Um, I guess we'll hit the drink twice. We don't want to give the Barbarian value, so we'll just stay away from the Barbarian. Okay. He can't... He can't punish me too bad here. Never mind, he did. That was actually pretty good. 1300 damage to the Striker just by hitting the... The tree and twice so pretty good so let's hit her twice or at least try to we did and the knight hit the archer now that was big the archer is almost dead thanks to the knight so that was big okay okay so now the berserker's ability is activated but uh honestly i can't punish too much here so we're just gonna hit it straight on we were able to hit the Barbarian as well, but if the Berserker would have hit the Barbarian, that would have been a nice punishment. But obviously I failed, and the bomb, uh, the, the, the Berserker might die here. Okay, never mind. The Berserker did not die. And unfortunately, I cannot. I could, but I'm not going to. I was going to say I wanted to punish them with the Berserker, but I can't. I could, but I don't want to take that chance, so I'm just going to hit... Hit it with the knight straight on. Oh, touch him. Oh, the berserker almost hit the tree and that would have that would have actually killed the tree and right? Yeah, that would have been enough to kill the tree and. Do not okay. The tree and is so uh the berserker is so alive. So we can actually do this, and we should also be able to hit the bomber. Like this. <gasps> nope. But we <laughs> we hit the barbarian twice. Okay. Did not go according to plan, but I'm still happy about the outcome. So now he is going to go for the Berserker, which obviously I understand. So we should have this in the books as well. So let's actually... Yeah, let's let's just take the Barbarian now, the Barbarian, Barbarian alive. We were also able to hit the, the Bomber now. That was pretty big, hitting the Bomber as well. So yeah, that's it. Uh, this guy should not win. He probably gave up. He did give up, didn't he? Sorry, I'm looking away. Like always, I'm just looking at my computer to see that everything is good. Yep, this guy gave up. Okay, how much health he has? Okay, so I just needed to hit uh, with the skeleton. Just needed to hit it towards the strike and we win. Bada bing, bada boom. There you go. Another win in the books. I lost count, but I'm just going to have a counter somewhere up here to let you guys know how many wins we have. Wins and losses, of course. Two wins. Okay, I need to stop winning just 10 trophies. I need to win more. So let's actually open an orb. Just to keep the orb slots rolling. So I'll, I'll be right back whenever the uh, the ad finishes. And we are back. 33.30, so I'm, we're... Literally almost the same as from when we started, and we've been playing for what, 20 minutes now? Half an hour? Something like that? We need to go up, dude. We need to win. We need to get those trophies. I'm trying to end on a positive note. We need to win. Um, but yeah, let me, uh, I think we're at the, what, half hour mark? So let me know down in the comments below that you're still here <laughs> at the half hour mark. Just, I... Uh, just let me just let me know now in the comments below. I love to read your guys' comments, even if it's just random shenanigans. I love to read your guys' comments. Um, so let's hit the archer, which will hit it towards the skeleton. Hopefully we can hit the archer twice with the berserker. Nope. But we were able to hit the bomber with the skeleton, so... Hey, skeleton's damage is... It's, come on, over 500 damage is pretty good. Come on, you cannot... You can't blame me for that. Okay. Um, okay, so let's let's just go for the mice bandit directly and we should be able to hit or these two The 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 warrior should bounce off the skeleton and the skeleton should hit her twice and the skeleton should hit somebody else to be honest with you Yeah, look at that the mice bandit just pff, 
just received how much? 1700 damage? Okay, so far good. Good. We are doing good. <laughs> and, okay, so... Decent play. He couldn't punish well enough, in my opinion. Okay, no, we're gonna do this. Mmm, actually... Is, if I hit the Mice Bender like this, I'm pretty sure... Yeah, I'm definitely gonna miss the Skeleton. So we're gonna hit the Striker like this. We should be able to hit the Skeleton. Yes, and we were, we were also able to take out... Did not take out. Almost take uh, took out the Bomber. The Bomber just needs one hit. Literally from everybody, anybody or the ball itself. Okay, so... The Warrior's turn. The Warrior cannot one-shot anybody. Pe do for okay, now it did. Okay, there you go. It literally just bounced. Bounced off the, wa uh, the wall to hit the, the Striker. That was decent play. Um, let's hit the Striker over here. We should be able to hit, not, not the Striker, the Warrior like this. The Bomber's dead. So the Bomb is activated, which right now it's Deadly Bomb is doing about 800 damage. Or 900 damage? What, what level is he? Yeah, max 900 damage. So hopefully this person messes up on the bomb. No, he did He did use the bomb very well. So let's actually punish the archer by hitting the archer towards the berserker. The berserker should kill her off. There you go. Still alive. Not anymore. <laughs> Not anymore. So now he is probably gonna. Oh, never mind. The Berserker will will tank for one hit, but then it will die if it gets a second hit from the Warrior. Nope. Okay. So let's hit the Warrior towards the Skeleton because the Skeleton is doing a little bit more damage than the Knight. There you go. And yeah, that should be GG. There's no way this person is gonna win. Lily probably has like 80 health or something. 79. Almost guessed the right number. So... GG, my man. We actually won three in a row. I'm I'm happy because we're gonna get additional trophies from it. It should be 10 trophies now, not 15. 15 was a little bit too much. In my opinion, I think they made the right decision about that. 15 trophies was a little bit too much. 25 plus 10, right? Yeah, 10 trophies. Hey, I'll take 35 trophies, dude. I'll take it. Um, okay, so we, we got the, sh the orb slots filled. So let's uh, open another one. So I'll be right back after the ad finishes. And we are back. 3365. Can we get to uh, 3700? Because I am struggling a little bit to get up. But if we win one, we'll get additional 10 trophies. We sh and if we face someone that's about the same trophies as I am, we should be able to get to 3,700. So please, fingers crossed, let me face someone that has a little bit more trophies than I do. Please. Let's see. And... Mm, this is not going to put me up at 3,700 trophies, I'm pretty sure. Um, What can we do here? Honestly, I do not know. Actually, let's do this. Let's hit both of these guys. The Treant should bounce off the Striker and make it hit the Barbarian again. Never mind. We did hit the... We hit the, the Treant twice or was it the ball that hit the Treant? Regardless, the Treant received additional damage, which I'm happy. Somehow he made that work, but at least it hit the Skeleton. The Skeleton can die. That's the whole point of the Skeleton, to die so that it can be revived. Um, I'm in a very uncomfortable position here. I honestly don't know what to do. We just hit the berserker. We'll just do this. Hopefully we can hit somebody. I'm in a very uncomfortable position. Yeah, well, we hit the barbarian, which is okay. At least we hit somebody. I was in a very uncomfortable position right there. It is the archer's turn. He is going to bounce off the wall to do something. Hit the skeleton, and the arrows just hit the, the knight, which is fine with me. I'm okay with that. Let's actually go for the Goblin. The Goblin is the right now the most dangerous card here. So yeah, let's hit the Goblin like this. That should be about almost a thousand damage. Oh, never mind. The Berserker hit the Goblin for... That was 1300 damage right there. He is going for the Skeleton, which is weird. Okay, so the Archer... Oh, not, that was the Goblin. The Goblin actually hit the, the Striker for... 
1200 damage somehow. So yeah, let's try to kill off the... This this might not kill off the, the goblin, to be honest with you. But let's see. It did because of the ball, so thank you. Right now, the other dangerous card is the Barbarian, because the Barbarian is level 20. So... And he is gonna use the Barbarian, so he's gonna use his ability to give the Barbarian a more ability than... Uh, or to use his ability, sorry, I cannot speak sometimes. So let's actually hit the archer like this. And hopefully the striker actually goes up and hit the barbarian. It did, and that was a lot of damage to both of them. Especially with the with the archer receiving 1900 damage. So now the archer is just almost dead. Do not hit the berserker, please. Thank you. So we can actually just hit straight on the Barbarian into the Skeleton. Okay, so the Barbarian and the Archer are almost dead. Yep, one hit. Can we... Oops, sorry, did not mean to touch the camera. And the Barbarian, yeah, they both need... They both just need one more hit. Clearly from anybody. They just need one more hit. Oh, he is gonna use the Treant. Killing off the knight, okay. I respect that play, that was very good. Let's actually try to kill off the archer and the barbarian. So hopefully we can we hopefully we can hit the barbarian by doing this. Yes, we were. Okay, so now it's just a train. There's no way he's gonna win. So that should be another win in the books. If unless he can make an insane play with the train, but the train has no ability now. Oof, okay, a third hit. And the striker is still alive. Actually, let's do this. Let's see if we can hit him twice by doing this. And hopefully we can hit towards the skeleton. Never mind, he surrendered. And we still killed him off anyway. So there you go, another one in the books. We are fourth win in a row, right? Or fifth win in a row? I can't count. Let's see. Four wins. Okay, so that was 26 trophies. Of course, we did not get to 3,700. But we are one winner right now. Let's actually open another orb slot, so I'll be right back after the ad finishes. And we are back. 3691. One more win to get to 3700. I really want to get to 3700. We are, I think, at 40 minutes now into the video, which, hey, I don't mind doing this. As long as you guys don't mind doing this, I don't mind doing this either. But like I said, I might be busy every now and then. Luckily, I didn't receive any interruptions like phone calls or some or messages or anything like that, so... So far, we're doing pretty good. He has the Assassin, of course, the Assassin Treant combo, which is just bad. Um, it is the Archer's turn, so we need to be careful where this Assassin lands, because he can just use the, assassin, uh, the Assassin's ability. Um, okay, he can still use... Never mind, he is going to go for the Knight. Okay, I thought he was going to use the Assassin's ability. Okay, that was a lot of damage. A lot. Decisions, decisions. Should I go for the bomb, uh, the the assassin, or should I go for the treant bomber? Let me go for the assassin. Let's just be safe, because right now the treant cannot capitalize too much. Other than oh, berserker, why didn't you hit the? Assassin, no! Okay, now this is gonna be bad. Never mind, it wasn't as bad as I thought it was gonna be. So let's just, yeah, let's just take him out. Yeah, we should be able to do this and make the Berserker bounce off the train to hit the Assassin. And hopefully, it hits. Never mind, I failed to do so again. <laughs> But he is not going to go for the Assassin, because the Assassin is alone. Okay, so the Knight and the Skeleton are dead. The Skeleton is going to revive itself, which... Why would you go for the Skeleton? So, let's actually do this. Let's hit the ball, so I can hit the Treant. And... Hopefully the Skeleton should hit the Knight. Uh, not the Knight, the Assassin. And it did. He did an emote, which I couldn't see because of the camera, so I'm just going to use this emote. Because, why not? It's funny to me. <laughs> it's just funny. So, the archer. Ooh, the freaking berserker is still not 
uh, act did not activate the, the ability just yet. It's so close. Okay, so the archer did receive a lot of damage right there. That was 1700 damage, so I'm okay with that. Is the striker dead? The striker is dead, and for some reason this guy is crying, so I'm just gonna throw an angry giant, because why not? <laughs> so we're just gonna hit both of these guys, because it's, it's gonna be... It's gonna be a lot of damage. Bada bing bada boom. Hopefully we can hit the bomber twice. We did. And we actually hit the skeleton, uh, this triant with the skeleton. So there you go. So these two are low health. And mine has about half health. Obviously the berserker has lo less than half. Considering the fact that the ability is activated. The bomb, please do not kill it off. It killed it off. Okay, let's see how much health does it. Okay, I can kill the archer with two hits. I can hit kill the triant with two hits. So if we can kill the archer right here. We should have a chance. We were only able to hit him one time. Excuse me? At least... It's blocked. Never mind, we lost. <sighs> I just want to get to 3700, man. So that's about 35 trophies I lost. 41 trophies, never, mi never mind. Apparently I lose more than I win, so... 3650. Oh my goodness, can we get to 3700? That's what I want to do. I want to reach 3700. I want to do that in this very video, at least for you guys. So let's go for another one. I might spend it, of course. Every time I see a might spend it, I get a little pissed off because it's overpowered. We are facing someone that has more trophies than we do, so this should be about 40 something trophies if we win. Okay, so he didn't capitalize that, that opening play too well. So let's actually hit the warrior like this. We should be able to hit him multiple times, actually. Yeah, we did. That was about 1400 damage, almost 1500 damage. That was very good. That's about health, health, half health for the warrior. So I'm okay with that. As long as the Jedi doesn't go crazy. Okay, the Jedi did not go too crazy here. So let's hit the warrior twice. Let's actually make the striker go for the Yeti. Hopefully we can make the striker go for the Yeti. Yes, there you go, and the Yeti and the warrior are dead. And he surrendered. Yeah, this guy knows it. I uh <laughs> I have no idea what kind of interaction just happened there. That was just insane. That was just crazy. It was literally an explosion right there happening. Wow. Okay, so I'm just gonna go open another orb, uh, orb, so I'll be right back after the uh, ad finishes. And we are back, 3692. I just need one more win so we can get to 3700. So can we can we do it, please? I would like to be able to do so. So please, let me get this one wins and I'll be happy with the video. But we're not gonna end it right there, obviously. We need to we need to play a couple of bit more because it still hasn't been an hour yet. My spend it, oh, this is the exact this is the, the exact same deck that we faced. Is this the same person? Is this the, is this the same person that we just faced? I need to look. I need to look. Like, this is... This is the exact same deck that we just faced that we just murdered. Uh, So let's hit the w wizard twice. Sorry. Okay, there you go. That should, that should be able to do it. Nope. But we were able to hit the Mice Bandit twice, at least. But I wasn't able to hit the Wizard twice. Uh, that was a little bit of a misplay, but we hit the Mice Bandit twice, which I'm happy about. Okie doke. Okay, so we should be able to... Yeah, we should be able to hit these two quite easily. If we could hit the Wizard, that'd be great, but we're not going to be able to do so. So let's just hit both of these guys. Oh, we did manage to hit the Wizard towards the ball. 230 damage, any damage is good damage. He is gonna do a lot of splash damage right there. Oof. That hurt. That hurt a lot. So let's actually, let's kill off this Mice Bandit. The Mice Bandit is scaring me just a little bit. The Mice Bandit is still alive, however. So unfortunately, the Knight and the Striker are low health. So he, he, he will capitalize on this. Maybe? Yeah, he did kill off my... The, actually, the knight is still alive. Whoa, hold, hold, hold on just a bit. So, let's do this. 
I would like to cut off the mice band, but I, at the same time, I would like to hit the wizard as well. So, if we can, we might be able to hit the mice bandit. You know what? The mice bandit is still alive, but I do not regret the decision that I did right there. Do not regret it. No regrets. <laughs> because right now. Ooh, okay. I may have spoken too soon. I might regret the decision. <laughs> um, we need to kill the warrior before the warrior kills the berserker. Never mind. I literally gave him a perfect position to use the warrior. No! Why? No! 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 Yep. Yep, yep, yep. I should have definitely killed... I should have definitely went for the mice bandit. That causes that cost me the game. Sadly, I should have listened to my instincts. <sighs> oh well. But we killed both of those players. Both of those troops, I mean. So now it is the warrior's turn. The warrior cannot insta-kill my, my skeleton. The skeleton still has high health. He was able to hit him twice, which, of course, whenever I try to do that, sometimes it just doesn't work. See, like that, I that was a big misplay on my part. I should have hit the, the Yeti twice, but obviously I failed. And the Yeti went crazy, but I'm still alive. I'm probably not going to be able to hit him twice. Yeah, yeah. Okay. It happens, it happens. Oh, I did not need to hit that button. Can we? Okay, thank you. <laughs> Oops, sorry about that. Discord. Speaking of which, <laughs> if you guys have Discord, by all means, I'll post a link down in the description below for you guys uh, to join. We have a lot, of, a lot of fun. Bot games, music games you just you name it we have it like you guys will probably enjoy it if you do have this course so please by all means join and you can have you know fun with me and other and other people too we have awesome uh, people in the discord so please please consider joining um okay so let's hit the my spend let's hit these two twice well we're not gonna be able to hit the berserker twice but maybe we can hit the my spend it twice maybe Yep, three times? No, close. Um, okay, so it is the warrior's turn. He is probably going to go for the striker. And the striker is going to hit the mice bandit. No, he has, he's actually going to use the mm -hmm. mice bandit to hit the the knight. Okay. Sorry about sorry about this card uh, just going off right there. Let's actually hit the skeleton towards the ball. It should hit the mice bandit and the berserker should hit the warrior. Yep, there you go. The skeleton almost hit the Yeti. That would have been a good play. So the Yeti is gonna freak out right here. He is gonna go run around. Oh, do not touch. It did not touch. Okay, it did not touch. Let's actually go for the Mice Bandit. Hopefully we can hit him t uh, two or three times right here. There you go. The It hit the ball, but I don't think it's... Yeah, it's not enough damage. So the Mice Bandit is still alive. So he may capitalize here with the Mice Bandit. No, he didn't. At least in my opinion, he didn't. So I cannot hit the mice bandit sadly. So we're just gonna go for this for the yeti. We should be able to hit him twice actually. Do this, bada bing bada boom. Then there you go. We did about fourteen hundred damage. That was very good. We need to kill that mice bandit though. Okay, my skeleton is dead, which I'm okay with, considering the fact that. Um, the skeleton can be revived. I said that we're gonna go for the mice bandit, but we need to capitalize this on the berserker. He just used the berserker, so he's not gonna be able to use his ability. I mean, he can still use the ability, he just gotta use it on friendly turns. So if we can kill off the berserker right now without him using his ability on us, I would be super happy. So let's see. He might be able to use it on the night, but other than that, I think we got this in the books. Look at that double hitting the uh, the Yeti. Very good. Excuse me. 
Warrior. Oh no, it's a Yeti's turn, okay. Is he gonna go for the skeleton? He actually went for the skeleton and killed him off. Wow. No. Wait, how much health does a, does his Berserker have? 950. So I don't... Actually, we might be able to do this. And hit him towards the ball. It should be able to kill him off. Let me move my camera a little bit. There you go. Yep. We actually killed both of them. Okay, so that's it. That's GG. There's no way this person can beat me now. He, he, may, be able, he may be able to one-shot me. One shot those people, sure. Ooh, okay. Well played. Well played. You wanna play this game? I'll play your game. My Berserker's ability is still not activated yet, but whenever it is, he is probably gonna be done. Let's do this. I. Oh, come on. Okay, so how much health? Okay, I can't. If Whenever my Berserker's ability is activated, I just need to hit him twice. And that's it. I'm in an uncomfortable position here, so this is actually quite scary. I'm just gonna do this and hope for the best. Yeah, I'm just gonna do this and hope for the best. Come on, come on, come on. <gasps> oh, is that it? No, he needs to hit me twice. He needs to hit me twice. He did. Oh my gosh, are you serious? Dude, come on. I just want to get to 30 to 3700. Can we do that? Can we do that? <laughs> How much time? Okay. Let me just play a couple of more. Oh my gosh, dude. Like can can we get to 3700? I that's that's the only thing I want to do now in this video. Just get to 3700. I am struggling with this grind, dude. So Banshee Yeti combo. Okay, so this person does have mm, uh, more trophies than we do, so this will be 50 trophies if we win. That was actually pretty good. 800, about 800 damage to the Banshee, and everybody else got almost 400. As long as the Yeti doesn't go crazy here. And by crazy, I mean he... Yep, he went crazy, and of course he was able to hit the Striker twice with the ability. Of course he somehow fi found a way to do that. The Yeti is almost dead. That should have killed him. But that was about 2700 damage to the Yeti, so I'm okay with that. And that he killed my knight. And he's about to kill my my striker. Wow. Wow. Okay. So let's just do this. The skeleton should hit the, the wizard. It hit him twice, so that's good. Okay. Okay. We just need to kill off the warrior. Okay, he wasn't able to do much there, which I'm okay. We can we can probably just hit the wizard twice and hopefully the skeleton will hit the warrior. Yes, and we actually hit the wizard three times killing him. Okay, hold. Hold. We might be able to make a comeback here. We need to kill the warrior now. Oh, is my berserker? Yes, my berserker is still alive. Hold. Hold. Can we? Yeah, we should be able to hit the... Yeah, we should be able to hit the warrior twice. By doing this. Right there. Yes, the warrior is still alive. Okay. We just need to hit the warrior once. Oh, he's actually going for the skeleton. Interesting play, sir. You do know if the skeleton dies, it revives with about 1200 health. Okay. Um, okay. <sighs> yeah, this is getting dangerous now. Actually, that, that was probably a good play on his part. Okay. Let's uh, we need to keep this tr the troops separated so it doesn't maximize the damage with the banshee. So I'm just gonna try to hit it like this, and the uh, oh, that was probably a bad play. L look at the way they're lined up. He just needs to hit the wall and it'll hit the berserker. Yeah. Oh my gosh, dude. Mm, let's see. Let's see here. We might. This is gonna be a risk. I got I got no other choice here. Oof. 
I mean, one more one more hit wasn't gonna wasn't gonna be enough, so we lost. Oh man, now we're doing very poorly. What's going on here? Now we're doing just very poor. I I'm curious about how much how many wins and loses do we have? So that's why I'm doing the uh, the wins and loss ratio. I, I honestly don't know how many do we have right now, considering the fact that I lost count. So I'm get, I'm just gonna use the edits so we can see how many we wins and losses we have. And so, and so that for you guys to know how many wins and losses do we have. We are down. Like, we are three, th we're 3603. Like, what happened here? What happened? <laughs> like, we started off decent. That was a that was a time that we got four wins in a row. And uh, we're just going down and down. Um, Okie doke. Let's actually hit both of these guys. We should be able to hit the Mice Bandit by hitting the Barbarian over here. We should be able to hit a third person. Yeah, we did. We actually hit the knight, not the warrior. I expected to hit the warrior, not the knight. The knight did receive some damage, so I'm okay with that. He is gonna try to use the mice bandit to do a lot of damage to the knight, I guess. Not the greatest of plays. So, unfortunately, I cannot hit the mice bandit, so we're gonna just do this. Let's actually hit it like this, so that the warrior bounces off the wall and should hit the skeleton. Yeah, should hit the skeleton. Yes, we were able to hit the warrior with the skeleton, so that was about 1100 damage. So, okay, a lot of damage to the to the knight, so good play right there. Now we're just gonna deal a lot of damage to the mice bandit, hopefully we can deal a lot of damage. Okay, that's death, isn't it? That is not death? How much health? 21 health. The mice bandit has 21 health. Excuse me? Excuse me. And that's death to the knight. Yep. He found a way to hit the knight. Okie dokie. So let's actually... Yeah, let's hit both of these guys. We should, be, we should be able to hit the mice bandit too. Yep. Okay. So about three, 375 damage to the knight plus killing off the mice bandit. Not the worst play. That was, that was probably the best I could do right there. Oh, he is gonna... Oof, he did not activate the ability. He is, the Berserker's act, uh, ability is almost activated. Let's hit the warrior twice. Okay, that was 900 damage. Uh, okay, literally, the Berserker needs one hit in order for the uh, ability to be activated. And he's gonna do so. Oh, that almost killed the Berserker. Yeah, that. Okay, let, we're gonna capitalize on this. Let's deal. That's probably killed the barbarian right there. I did not, but we did kill off the warrior, which is good. The knight is the one that's scaring me, however, because he has a lot of health, a lot. So we try. We're gonna need to try to find a way to. Oh gosh, are you serious? Okay, this actually might be another loss. Oh my goodness, how many losses are we gonna get in this very video in a row? So let's just do this. Oh, okay. Decent damage. He is gonna go for the striker, okay. Hopefully he doesn't... Okay, so he did fail to hit the, the skeleton, which is good. How much health? Okay, so the barbarian needs one more hit. So if we can manage... Yeah, we should be able to hit the knight. Yeah, we should be able to hit the knight. We missed the knight. Oh my gosh. Like I said, any damage is good damage, and that, that I needed that damage. He, literally about 2,000 health. We are at 2,600. So right now we have more health, but obviously this uh, the knight has that shield. So we're gonna do this. Yeah, let's do that. Whoa! Where did that come from? <laughs> Where did that come from? Okay, that was crazy. Yeah, good game. Oh, he, I, I honestly don't know what he says. I'm just gonna, oh, I'm just gonna give him the zombie face. <laughs> okay, that was insane. That was crazy. Um. Okay, so I'll be right back. I'm gonna open another orb. So I'll be right back after this. Uh, the orb slot finishes, or the the ad. Sorry. And we are back. We're at three. 
day 35, I think we are back to where we started. Literally, I've been playing for an hour and literally no, no changes at all except by completing a couple of quests and opening these orbs. So, literally, no change. No change at all. And we have been playing for, I think, yeah, an hour. It has been an hour. But, you know, with a couple of edits I gotta do, it's gonna be probably less than an hour. So, I need to. So, I'm, I'm gonna play like maybe one or two more games. Hopefully, we can win the next one or two games. Excuse me. Excuse me. So, let's see. We have the sorceress. Okay, so this guy is at 4,000. So, let's. Okay, so he did enchant my. Uh, he enchanted my skeleton, which is fine. I'm totally okay with that. So, let's hit the skeleton. Yeah, we were able to hit the Barbarian twice, the Paladin and the Sorceress one each, so I'm okay with that. The Thunder Idol is actually gonna get a lot of value here, actually. Ouch. And he just uh, enchanted the Berserker, which I did not want. That was a no-no. So let's hit the, the Sorceress like this. Okay, so the Sorceress and the Thunder Idol got some good damage so super stoked about that it is a paladin's turn is he gonna yeah oh he looks like he is gonna heal the uh the thunder right over there the skeleton is dead but he will be revived so i'm okay with that so let's take out the the sorceress the striker should hit the thunder idol okay so the knight is not enchanted, and uh, if the skeleton stays alive, the, skele uh, the skeleton will, will have that enchantment removed, so... Just hold your horses, we might be able to make a little bit of a comeback here. I say comeback because I'm pretty sure we are, even though we are up by a, by a troop, the... Oh, actually, let's see. We should be able to take out this thunder idol, right? Mm. Let's actually do let's actually hit it this way. The knight should go up. Oops, sorry about that. Yep, and the thunder idol died. Okay. Whew, hold. This is this is for 50 trophies. 50 trophies. Yeah, he is gonna heal the barbarian. There's no I would heal up the barbarian too, or do you want to take out the skeleton? Okay, not bad actually. That was pretty good. So let's actually hit or try to hit the Barbarian twice. If we can take out the Barbarian, that'll be GG. Oh. There you go. We took out the Barbarian. It is literally just... Yep, he surrendered. <laughs> this guy knows it. This guy clearly knows it. 50 trophies right there. Where are we? 3685. Okay. Okay. I'm gonna play one more. One more. If we can get to 3700, that'll be the end of the video because I've been playing for about an hour. But I'm gonna open this. Oh, I can act. I I can actually not open a orb, so I'm just gonna stop with that. No, no gems, please. So I'm gonna play one more. We will get to 3700 if we win because I'm also at a two win streak. So one more will give me 10 additional trophies. So cross your fingers for me, people. Let's hope. Hopefully, we can win this one. It'll be a bad loss as well, so... Let's see. Not the greatest starting hand, to be honest with you. I guess I'll just hit the tree and twice. And it's just a skeleton, so I honestly don't mind sacrificing the skeleton. Like, it can be up in, in their base. I don't mind it. Because if the skeleton dies, it, 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 it'll be revived unless he goes for the skeleton. Even when the skeleton is just a, a pile of bones, so... So let's let's hit both of these guys, I guess. Yeah, let's hit both of these guys, and hopefully the train will go for the skeleton as well. Nope. Okay. Um, he cannot use his ability proper. Oh, he is gonna try to use his ability on the goblin. Oh, never mind on the bomber to hit the berserker. Maybe he just hit just the uh striker, not the berserker. Okay. So let's actually hit the goblin like this. It should bounce off the wall and hit the skeleton. Plus, we should be able to hit the archer as well. Yeah. The goblin is dead. Ladies and gentlemen, the goblin is dead. Hold. The goblin was one of the most dangerous cards. Now it's... The bomber is dangerous, of course. He's literally doing about 700 damage per hit. So... Okay. 
the okay the striker is almost dead i don't know why i struggle trying to find the words the striker is almost dead let's hit both of these troops there you go plus we dealt damage with the skeleton yeah the skeleton literally hit the archer plus the bomber so those were good damage i am happy with that he can kill i mean i don't want him to kill off the striker and but if he does, I honestly do not mind it, because we got three other troops that have decent health. The skeleton is, is a max health, actually, so... What is he gonna do? Oh, sorry about that. Um, okay. Okay, okay. So... Hmm. Should we... Sorry about that. Sorry about this cord going off again. Um, should we... Actually, let, let's see how much health does the bomber have. It'll still be alive. Mm. Let's go for the bomber instead. Yeah, let's go for the bomber instead. Oh, I actually missed the skeleton hit with the... Yeah, I actually missed the bomber with the skeleton hit. I wanted, I wanted to hit it with the skeleton twice. But I did hit it towards the berserker, so it wasn't a total loss. And he failed to use the ability on the bomber to hit the knight, so I don't think he wanted to do that. So let's. Hmm. Let's steal damage to the archer. Is that enough to kill the archer? No. Yes. It got hit three times. Okay. So now we gotta be careful because it is the bomber's turn. Hopefully, he is probably gonna go for the berserker. Yep. Hopefully it is not enough to take it out. Okay, no it's not. So we're gonna do this. So we're gonna hit him straight up. Hopefully the Berserker will hit the corner and go up. Nope. As okay, as long as the Berserker is not near the bomb, it is not, just a skeleton. If we can keep the Berserker alive, we should have this because he is gonna use the tree to try to, okay. The bomb was actually not near the uh, the skeleton. Okie dokie. So I think now we got this in the bag. Oh, okay. So I wanted to hit him twice, but of course I failed. But it's just a tree against three troops, so I don't. Yeah, there's no way he is gonna win, especially when the uh, the knight is still alive. So so let's just hit him straight up because it's just the knight. Oh, okay, yeah. Now the Treant needs one more hit. Yeah, one more hit. He needs to kill the knight somehow. And the Berserker as well, so... Yeah, that's it. That's GG. So there you go, guys. This should be 3,700. Took Literally took me an hour to do so. Like, oh my goodness, that took me an hour. Yep, there you go. Plus 10. There you go, 3705. I have no idea why it took me an hour to do so, but there you go, guys. We finally reached 3700. I played an hour. Let me know down in the comments below if you guys actually prefer hour-long videos mm. of ladder grinding. Oh, sorry about the uh, the Discord. <laughs> it just It's just going crazy now. But uh, let me know down in the comments below if you guys prefer an hour-long videos of me la uh, ladder grinding. Just let me know, and I'll be happy to continue to do so if I have the time, of course. <sighs> well, guys, thank you so much for watching this video if you guys literally watched the entire video. If you guys did watch the entire video, please let me know down in the comments below that you watched the entire video and did you loved every moment of it or you didn't like it. Just let me know down in the comments. Well, guys, thanks again. Uh... Well guys, uh, thanks for watching this video. If you guys liked the video, please give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel for more Smashing 4 videos. Um, yeah, this this was actually a lot of fun playing for an hour. We actually got up to 3700 trophies. It took me long enough, but regardless, I did it in this video. Uh, let me know down in the comments um, what challenge deck do you, uh, do you guys want me to do. I already have one planned for tomorrow's video, so I hope you guys stay tuned for that. Um, also, I, also, uh, Discord, <clears throat> excuse me, sorry, I'm losing my voice because I've been, literally been speaking for an hour. Um, Discord, um, if you guys have Discord, by all means, join. It'll be happy to, to just talk to you guys every day or just talk about random things. It could be about Smashing 4, uh, you know, strategies, it could be other things, life, you name it, we can just talk 
it'll be a lot of fun if you guys do this uh, decide to join Discord. Huh. Well guys, this was a long video. <laughs> I'm gonna take a break, I'm gonna edit the video and just post it uh, later on. Um, well guys, thanks again for watching this video and I'll see you guys in the next one. Take care.